my Nini. Come on. Nini is a happy child. How dare parent provoke Nini? Like what? I mean, that was how Nini got really provoked this afternoon by parent. And guys, the, the, the shocking thing about it is that parent is one of those persons that actually has some kind of love attraction yeah some sort of love affections for nini i mean it's very obvious he has kind of confessed it before indirectly so one would expect that when it comes to nini he will thread carefully he will try his best not to fall into her bad books or to even provoke her at all but guys it seems as though the task that piggy gave to the housemates today has kind of put an edge on everybody everybody's under tension because hey there are prices to be won and of course it is a task it is a competition so no matter how many friends you have in the house tempers will flare tension will be eating up everybody now this was how it started the housemates were given their global task by big brother and they were supposed to do i think four different stages of the task before they finally ended it with the last one and so guys they've been doing so well all through the day and then before you knew it there was a particular task that they were supposed to keep their hands or their fingers suspended rather and guys <laughs> it wasn't an easy task to actually accomplish because some of the housemates were faltering their fingers were wavering here and there and then guys it turned out that paris finger was actually shaking and according to what some of the housemates said to play that game Pera had used his left hand which they knew was not going to be solid because Pera is not one of those individuals that uses his left hand for anything he is a rightist if that is what they call it guys i am not sure please let me know in the comment section below what they call people who use their right hands for activity according to nini she had jokingly gone to go and ask parent that parent was your hand shaking and parent said no that was actually at the arena grounds where they were playing the game parent had denied that his hands or his fingers were shaking but then by the time they got into the house some other housemates who had noticed that Perez's hand was obviously shaking during the task had said it jokingly. And Nini now, being the jolly go fellow that she is, she had gotten overly excited and said, Oh, okay, she called Ari, her friend, that, oh, let's go and tell Perry that his hand was actually shaking. She did, he denied it before. And so Perry was inside the restroom. So Nini had gone to the dressing area and had been calling Perry's name that, Oh, Perry, ah, she did, you said your hand was not shaking. They said your hand was shaking. That kind of question like that. And then Perry had got really upset. He had taken offense by Nini's question. And so when he came out of the toilet, according to Nini, he was yelling at her. He was shouting at her. Guys, we're not able to see that particular part of um, Perry shouting at Nini. So I'm just going to play the clip so you can see how it all went down. He was using his left hand. Yes. How can you use your left hand? Yes. And his left hand is shaking. Yes. Exactly. You're using your left hand. Now, that was exactly what infuriated Nini because, number one, she can't really believe that this is one person that she always jokes with in the house. So, how did, you know, how did things between them just go from zero to 100? I mean, what really warranted him shouting or yelling at her like that? What really warranted him raising his voice at her like that? And now, Perry, on the other hand, is claiming that he was joking. And Nini was saying, no, I was the one that was joking with you. It was not that deep. All I wanted to hear you say was that your hand or your finger was not shaking because you had denied it before. Now, people in the house who had seen you, who were witnesses, they had said that now nah, your finger was actually shaking, you know? So you coming to deny it now, all I just needed to hear you say was that you did not, your finger was not shaking. But then guys, Pere <laughs> was not having it. And so... He was like, no, that he too was also joking. But the rest of the other housemates who were there, they saw that Perry was obviously joking or provoked. And so if at all, he was claiming that he was just joking, that it could mean that he was deliberately trying to provoke Nini. And guys, nobody, I mean, absolutely nobody has ever seen or heard Nini being provoked or being engaged in any form of altercation in the Shia Eye mansion before. But guys, this evening, we actually saw it happen. I mean, guys, I was really surprised though, hearing Nini shout and, you know, raise her voice like that. Don't try it with me, don't try Guys, in case you're not Nigerian and you're wondering how some Edo girls behave, some Edo girls, that some girls from a particular part of the south, south of Nigeria, they can be very, very odd tempered. They don't like it when people challenge them unnecessarily, guys. And that was exactly what Perry did to Nini today. And that seriously infuriated her. And I feel like she also felt like, oh, isn't that this guy is looking at me because I am female? He can just open his mouth and yell at me. 
Does he think that I am a baby? Does he think that I am too small to talk to him? You know, and so Nini was really livid. Like she kept on warning Perry. And guys, to be very honest, Nini is very cute when she's angry. <laughs> No, frankly, guys, Nini is very, very cute when she's angry. I mean, I'm looking at her, at her angry and warning Perry. And to be very, very frank with you guys, I just couldn't take her serious because I was asking myself, is this girl actually angry or is she singing? I don't know because she sounds so sweet and she looks so fragile while she was angry. And so most of the housemates, you know, they were just carrying her away that Nini can't, that Nini can't. But she was very, very, like she was very, very living. And the reason why she's really living is because. Pera is one person that she jokes with a lot in the house. They have a very, very good relationship, like communicating relationship. They are very, very good friends. You know, they joke a lot. They joke a lot. They have very, very good chemistry, you know, with regards to platonic friendship. So what Nini is confused about is where was all of that negative energy coming from? Was Pera upset about something? Did somebody piss Pera off and then he's transferring all his aggression on me? And guys, another thing that really pissed her off is the fact that Pera is not being apologetic at all about the way he attacked her and that was the same thing that most of the other housemates were seeing you know because for them Pera you are at fault so the least you could do is to apologize to this girl but no Pera was not apologizing now another person that made this whole thing quite hilarious yeah I'm sorry guys but everything was just funny to me because in my mind this is not really a serious confrontation or altercation at all because the two people involved <laughs> They are not really sworn enemies. They are friends that will definitely make up as time goes on. So it was Arin. Arin, of course, is Nini's close friend in the house. So Arin witnessed everything that happened. That she was trying so hard to explain to Pere that this is exactly what she did. That got Nini upset. So you should at least accept your wrong and apologize or something. But just understand where she was coming from. And guys, we know that in that house, Arin has a PhD in explanations. So she was trying so hard to explain to Pere. But from the look of things, guys, I have a strong feeling that Pere knew what he was doing. He was very very intentional and deliberate about what he did and so he wasn't budging at all for him He holds nobody Nobody whatsoever any form of apology what has happened has happened so he doesn't care anyways guys let's see how it goes if these two people are going to kiss and make up or not and i'll see you all on another episode of frankly speaking with gloria elijah by the way guys let me know your thoughts about this rift that happened today between Pere and nini in the comment section below and i'll do well to respond to all of you bye